The 90 Day Fiancé franchise became notorious for its wildly incompatible couples, but it is well known for its franchise favorites, who showcase their romantic compatibility on and off screen. One thing that has become clear over the past eight years of franchise content is that some pairs have better chemistry than others. Now, it's time to discover the most electric 90 Day Fiancé franchise couples, whose sizzling connections did not go unnoticed. Some of the most notorious 90 Day Fiancé couples are perceived as having little to no chemistry with each other. Larissa Lima and Colt Johnson were polar opposites who definitely did not click, while the same could easily be said of Jorge Nava and Anfisa R. Kipchenko. Meanwhile, Infamous franchise couple Mohamed Jbali and Danielle Mullins notoriously failed to connect and were not sexually compatible. While such relationships became known for their intense drama, fans also appreciate getting to know real couples who share a future together. Most fans of the franchise originally tuned into the 90 Day Fiancé franchise to view genuine depictions of international love and some couples have not disappointed viewers. Couples with palpable chemistry were praised for having real connections that went beyond mere physical attraction. While some American cast members have been accused of traveling to other countries for international hookups, other cast members proved that their chemistry is the real deal for lasting relationships. Find out which franchise couples still maintain their strong chemistry. Chantel and Pedro Gimino have long since been considered one of the most attractive franchise couples and they have maintained their position at the top of the list when it comes to couple chemistry. The Atlanta beauty and her Dominican Republic native husband first starred on season 4 before landing their own spin-off show, The Family Chantel. Though Chantel has denied rumors of plastic surgery, many viewers can't help but notice how her looks have changed since she first appeared in the franchise. However, she has always been a beautiful woman. Meanwhile, Pedro has transformed thanks to a fitness kick that has left him ripped. Overall. Chantel and Pedro are a glamorous couple who have the kind of chemistry that their fans can sense. Former 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days couple Omar L. Bakauer and Avery Mills are both good-looking individuals with a genuine connection that translates well to viewers. The American woman converted to Islam before meeting her Syrian husband online, and they now live together in the U.S. After residing in Dubai, Avery and Omar are both appealing on their own, and their charisma is intensified by their kind personalities intellectual drive, and career goals. It's clear to their followers that Omar and Avery share a real bond that kept their marriage strong despite lengthy visa delays. Avery and Omar's chemistry and compatibility have led them to become one of the most beloved franchise couples. Yara Zaya and Jovi Dufresne might not be every viewer's cup of tea, but many 90 Day Fiancé fans can't deny that the Ukrainian woman and American man just click. Jovi and Yara's chemistry was clear from the start, and they met while Jovi was traveling for her work. They had a whirlwind romance that included plenty of traveling. When Jara joined Jovi in New Orleans on a K-1 visa, they quickly became pregnant with baby Mila. Though Jovi and Yara both have attitude problems sometimes, they make an attractive couple, and they proved that they could make things work on 90 Day Fiancé, happily ever after. Many franchise fans believe that the couple will make a return to the franchise sometime soon. Related, 90 Day Fiancé, why Hamza should reconsider marrying Memphis Kyle and Noon Huckabee remain one of the most beloved 90 Day Fiancé franchise couples due to their warmth, mutual love, compatibility, and chemistry. Viewers adored the season 3 couple for the way they brought out the best in each other. Kyle and Noon were hailed for being one of the more relatable and less dramatic couples in the extended franchise. However, their chemistry was clear from the start, as American Kyle was memorably thrilled, but nervous to pick up his Thai partner from the airport. Kyle and Noon have since maintained their romance, and many viewers are happy that their connection has led to a healthy and happy marriage. Alexi and Loren Brovarnik are another franchise couple known for their good looks and strong connection. Though American mother Loren has a reputation for being bratty, she is undeniably beautiful and earns plenty of praise for embracing her postpartum figure. She always keeps it real about how her body changes after she gives birth. Meanwhile, her Ukrainian-Israeli husband Alexei is widely considered to be one of the most attractive men in the franchise, as well as a hard worker and devoted father. Though some franchise fans find Alexei and Loren too boring to have their own spin-off show, they also have many fans who appreciate seeing an authentic look at marriage and having kids. Former couple, and current best friends, Tim Malcolm and Veronica Rodriguez are one couple that has superb chemistry that is now platonic rather than romantic. Tim appeared on Before the 90 Days and introduced his ex Veronica before the best friends became one of the most beloved couples to appear on Pillow Talk. Tim and Veronica are hailed for their hilarious commentary, 
as the best friends play off each other wonderfully and have clear chemistry. Though some viewers are just happy to see Tim and Veronica together as friends, other 90 Day Fiancé fans have questioned if the duo should get back together, especially since their close friendship interferes with their dating lives. On the other hand, Tim's ex-girlfriend Jennifer Tarazona has been slammed for her lack of chemistry with her fiancé, Jesse Meester.